I'm Caroline and we're here with Gorinda Charter. She's one of the UK's most respected filmmakers. You've quickly become one of my heroes, which oh, means that I'm like, gush, gush, gush. Um, oh, we'll, we'll change that after this, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> so we're here to talk about Vice Roots House, uh, which is your new film. Mm. Tell us about the personal story of your own in, in making this film. Vice Roots House is set as it says, in the house of the Viceroy in India in 1947, when India was to be granted freedom from the British Empire. So it's the last days of the British Raj. I, Louis Mountbatten, am to be the last Viceroy of India. So the British Empire's view and the history that I was, I was brought up with was that when Mountbatten arrived, there was rioting going on and it escalated and quite a lot of violent rioting. And so Mountbatten had no choice but to divide the country. So it was divided on religious grounds and two sections were given over to Muslims um, as Pakistan and all the Hindus and Sikhs who lived in those areas had to migrate to India. New nations are rarely born in peace. It's got to be a clean cut. It's a bloody axe cleaving right through people's lives. So my family ended up being on the wrong side of the border in Punjab and ended up in the Pakistani side. And so like many others uh, became refugees overnight. In the film, Gandhi says, we're brothers with one soul. And I took away that uh, there's more that connects us than divides us. Was this a type of message that you were trying of to Of course, you know, it's a very turbulent time. I'm making a film here that is taking on the British Empire's view of history. Also, India and Pakistan's sort of national history. Uh, but I wanted to tell the history from my perspective as a British Indian woman but not just that also a mother and i think it's very important that that uh, delineation is made because we as mothers rarely get to make big movies big historical movies about turbulent times i mean the book i'm thinking of is joy luck club you know uh, but of course that was made by wayne wang a man but but by being a woman um and being a mother, you know, I think that's affected how I've told such a turbulent story. But I chose to not show that violence in a particular way, although it's present, but also by not depicting it uh, graphically, but dealing with it emotionally, I think it's quite powerful. And I think a lot of that comes from uh, being a mother. <laughs>